Well, right on cue, some cooler weather to ring in the month of November, and that chilly feel is here to stay for the weekend. Highs are only going to be in the 50s for your Saturday. The wind is going to be considerably calmer, though. You are going to notice a much more still setting this evening and overnight. Still seeing 13 mile an hour winds with temperatures that are in the lower 50s, and you want the hoodie and the light jacket for those high school games with temperatures near 50 at kickoff, falling down into the mid 40s by the fourth quarter. Be sure to check that free WTOL 11 weather app. Our hour by hour forecast drops us down to the 40s by 8 o'clock PM. If you're heading out to the walleye home opener, it is going to be brisk feeling by the time it, you leave the stadium. Here's those current temperatures right now. We're in the low to mid 50s near the lake shore. Temperature of 51 in Toledo, 52 in BG, 50 in Wauseon. The winds are slowly but surely diminishing. Still seeing those 18 mile an hour gusts a bit breezy out towards the Lake Erie shores and islands as well. Hour by hour forecast that's going to drop us back into the mid 30s. So you will want a couple layers for that morning walk into the afternoon. Good leaf raking weather with sunshine and calm winds expected. That forecast does include mostly sunny skies. No worries of any rainfall and winds are going to be light at zero to five miles per hour. The full weekend outlook does stay on the cooler side. Saturday will be your chance to soak up the sunshine because Sunday could include a few isolated late day showers. Mostly dry weather is expected, but during the afternoon and evening, that'll be the best chance to see a few light and scattered rain showers. Also, don't forget we fall back an hour with the end of daylight saving time on Sunday. That means some very early sunsets, 525 p.m. However, you will enjoy a little more daylight in the morning. Perhaps good news for those of you who like a little more light out at the bus stop and for the morning drive. As far as weather impacts ahead, calm weather tomorrow. The weekend does bring the chance for some showers late and the showery weather is likely to continue through Election Day. In fact, Election Day is going to be windy with some showers late in the day. The long range outlook does turn cooler after a couple very mild feeling days. Heading out to the polls, temperatures are already going to be in the mid 60s before work. Lunchtime mid 70s and the afternoon could include a few rain showers as our next cold front arrives and that is going to kick up the wind as well. 10 to 20 mile per hour sustained winds are expected, but some wind gusts maybe up to 30 miles per hour. Their chances for showers will return late Sunday as well as Monday and Tuesday. Windy weather for Election Day and then that cold front is going to bring on some more seasonable November weather by the middle of the week. Long range trend does include a few showers next weekend with temperatures easing back into the upper 50s.